honestly, when I think about it, in high school, if I hadn't gotten you would have done very very well. mixed up with clubs, yeah. I could have been a star athlete. I could have gone to probably well, an Ivy League college. Well, that's what happens when you get involved with drugs. I know, mom. But you I really mean, didn't have to go. But there. I mean, that's the honest thing. That's the that is shows you how it robs somebody of their life. Mmm. Isn't that good? Yum. Wow. I mean, let's not act like I had my life robbed for me. That's a little. You did. All right. Let's see. Well, what's the matter? That's the truth. In certain years, not your whole life. I'm sorry, but I got There's to trade experience the rave scene of the 90s, and I just wouldn't trade that for anything. I don't care. Harvard, bye. I don't no, care. No, those were years that would have been very cherished by us that we lost. Au contraire, mother dearest. I didn't lose years of my life. I was at the limelight in the tunnel. How many people can say that? Not that many. What about this? What? To this day, you still... Don't say you're pretty every day. I'm supposed to every day look at her That's and say, true. you're so pretty. I don't need compliments all the time, but I don't want criticisms all the time. Okay. And everything I do, you have a criticism for. I'm not doing this right. Well, I'm not you know, doing that right. You might have a point there. Mm -hmm. That's ridiculous. You said I'm addicted to plastic surgery, which I find very rude. Well, let, you know not what? true. Three surgeries in six months are not great. Do another one and I'm gonna go into addiction. Now I'm calling it dependency. Go one more step and I'll call it addiction. Don't have any more. No, you look great as you are. I'm done. You know how much money I've spent? <laughs> yeah. I'm not That's doing enough. anything anymore. That's enough. No, and you look great as you are. Do I wish she would be less critical? Absolutely. Because I do think it has an effect on me and who I am. Maybe I can blame her for getting addicted to plastic surgery. Put all that in. That's for me and Ramona. And Ramona has loungewear for me, You're too. Not right now. Sonia Rita. Sonia, oh my God, I miss you. I love you though. I am so exhausted. You and I, I gotta tell you, I don't think you realized how sick I was. I checked in with you a couple times, but I didn't hear back from you. So I imagine, you know. I was dying. I will tell you, my assistant was on a. You know the thing Harry Dubin has to do when we're having sex? What, inhaler? You got an inhaler? An inhaler. I can't wait to spend time with you. I miss you. It's been so long. You've been a little quarantine baby. <laughs> I guess I'm going to say Ramona's in her room. We both have antibodies. Oh, so you might as well share your antibodies in the same bed. We'll have one big orgy. It'll be fabulous. Well, if you make out with me, I'll be fine. All right, well, listen. Save me some good stuff for the weekend, OK? I love you. <laughs> Bye. Catch Bye. Bar, I love you. Bye. Oh my God, I speak so much about Lewin and I love her so much. I do love Ramona too, but I I always say about him. I don't know what to tell you guys. I love him. I just can't stop talking <laughs> Why is this here? I can hear you. <laughs> I love you, Lou. Yeah, I don't know yeah, why. I heard you talking about me. You better watch this. I, so I no, I said I love you so much. I don't yeah, know why I always talk about, about him. Back about me. Red-handed. Sonia says she doesn't drink at home. I don't, I don't know about that. <laughs> She's so nuts. I'm eating chocolate. I'm like, there's no dessert. Okay. <laughs> I never worry about food with Singer, but if she don't have dessert, she's she flipping. She has no dessert, darling. She's flipping. That's what happens after COVID, mm -hmm. man. Mm. Everybody freaks about the COVID once you've had it. Mm -hmm. You're like a leper. Not what happened to your guy, the one from Ebony's girl? Grew up on bacon. My grandmother made bacon every weekend. I love it. There's nothing wrong with it. I don't read the reports. Fake news. It's healthy for you. When I had COVID, he didn't send me even a chicken soup, you know, like in New York. It's, you say, oh, oh I'm sick. Oh, really? Forget COVID. Like, you send like chicken in the pot, and he's Jewish. He should know better. Send me the Figure freaking bird he's doting over you. That's no, usually not guys. even flowers. So Bradley has fizzled out, to say the least. Honestly, I gave it my best effort. I was a listener. I was available for Bradley's phone calls. I even did FaceTimes while he was watching TV. But when I don't get flowers, and then when I'm sick with COVID, not even a chicken in a pot, no, that's not Mr. Right. I think I'll go back to Mr. Right now for a moment then. And nothing for Valentine's Day? You sent me more than he sends. <laughs> Frenchie, you know, he would always come with flowers for me and for the right. intern and for everybody. Yeah, but he's French. That's the difference. American guys are not romantic. I think we need to go to Europe. 